guys welcome back to my channel i am so excited to drop like on my video of course and if you're new hey girl make sure you hit that subscribe button and stick around because i'll be doing a ysl card holder giveaway really soon you guys i'm excited for it so yes make sure you subscribe so you can be in the giveaway as well but yes you guys by the title i'm doing my review on the paxi handbag back there so let me grab her really quick like, yes, she's so cute, right? I'm also thinking of doing a what's, oh, not what's, wow. A versus one between this one and the Cachette Matisse back there. I don't know, I feel like they're so similar, right? Almost, because they have like the back pocket and stuff. But yes, you guys, this is the Passy handbag from, Shh, I almost said Chanel, from Louis Vuitton. My mind is not it right now. But yes, you guys, this is so cute. I was thinking for a second because I'm like, it is a cute bag, but what I don't love is this. I don't know, do you guys love that? Or I feel like it makes the bag look so tacky and almost like fake in a sense because if you see like the ones that's like sold on like the I don't know like when you're walking down like somewhere in like <laughs> New York or like LA or something and then they're like selling bags like on the street I feel like this kind of looks like that a little bit it's cute but that's the only thing I don't know how I feel about that like do I like that or it's just like big and kind of um bulky but I don't know I guess that, that's what kind of makes the bag but this is suede on the inside you guys and this is made in France I don't know if y'all are going to be able to see that. Let's see. Yes. Made in France, girl. It's, you know. But I'm telling you guys, I really do feel like there's a difference. You can come for me if you want. But seriously, like, there is a difference in the quality of the handbags. I'm not kidding. So. <laughs> but that's, again, just my humble opinion. But yes, I have my um thingies in here. And yes, it's Passy Monogram. Go ahead and get that code if you want it but i'm obviously you can just put it in the, um the thing but it just says um textile lining blah 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 you know the usual stuff but that's right there but yes you guys what's cute about this one is it has a zipper right here there's the back pocket over here there's a bigger pocket here and then there's a little pocket here and then a slip pocket back here so you can slide your phone you want to put your card in here a receipt like a valet little card or like a parking pass whatever you want to put in here in the back that i think is a really really good feature and i wish most bags would come with which they don't which i don't know why they don't think of those but yeah so i think it's really good like this gucci one right here it's big i wish it had like a slip pocket you know it would be easy to utilize it and um put like a like a receipt or something you have quickly in your hand you just want to put it somewhere but you guys i love the fact that this does have the leather strap to it as well and then the chain one so you can either do it like this or you can double it up and then you know what there's another thing on here oh these little hooks right here you can put like a little cute um where's my oh here it is my own little key thing from Louis Vuitton, like the, it's like a bag charm. But you can, you can hook this on here. Let's see what it looks like. Um, let's do it on this side. But yeah, see, it kind of like gives it something. I don't know if you would want to use it like that, but I think it's kind of cute, right? There we go. See, see something like that. It's kind of cute. But yeah, you can do something like that as well. But this is just like a bag charm. Um, but yeah, you guys, I like the fact that it is free of Vaquetta. You guys know how I feel about the Vaquetta. I do not like the Vaquetta. I think it just, I don't, I know it's a part of Louis Vuitton. It's, they love like the honey color and stuff, but it's just like, I have to be so mindful and like scared almost like, oh my gosh, what if I get it dirty? If it rains, 
randomly, which it won't because I'm in Arizona. It's 115 right now. It's burning hot. But yeah, you guys, actually we do have monsoon season. So hey, what if a random monsoon wants to come out and then I have my Baquetta bag with me and then I'm like gonna cry in my house to my husband because my bag got water stains on it. So yeah, you guys, this is so cute. But let me um do a little lawn shot for you guys. But yeah, see, it's like such a vibe, right? Almost like so cute. I do think this bag is like super cute. But like I said, I don't know how I feel about this big old charm thing right there. That is the only reason why I'm like hesitant to like completely love this bag. But yeah, I mean, if you do crossbody, that's another amazing thing to um how to utilize this bag with the crossbody situation. I think it's really, you know, gives you your hands are free. If you're a mom on the go, you can definitely be hands free. So, but yeah, you guys, I think she's a cutie. I'm trying to keep this video short and get to the point. So I won't keep y'all here for too long. But yeah, guys, and another thing I noticed is not a lot of people talk about this, but if you know, when I first got this bag, it wasn't like squished like this and i've seen some people's bag where it's like really 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 ugly i don't want to do it because i don't want to ruin mine but it's like that's something that bothers me too about it like this i want it to be flat like when i got it you know and it's like coming like this so i don't know if i like that but another cool feature of this one is it says louis vuitton and then it says whatever it says right here Oh, I can't read that, so I'm not going to butcher it. Oh, no, it's not going to focus enough to show you guys. Oh, I just thought of my ring. Oh, my goodness. I cannot read that, y'all. I'm trying to show you guys, but it's not going to focus enough to um, focus. And you guys can read it, but yeah, it's like really pretty. But besides this big chunk of it, can you guys let me know what you think? Like, do you think that this is a nice bag like to have especially with this chunky big logo out there like that or do you i mean i know it's like logos all over the bag i i understand but it's like logos all over the bag plus this humongous thing you know and another thing ladies um i did take my sticker off but you guys got to be careful this will scratch like nobody's business okay so be very mindful when you get this bag that it, this will scratch i don't know about you guys using it as like an everyday bag I personally say maybe not so much because once I get stretched, I don't know, I just feel like it's gonna look so ugly. So, but yeah, um, let's see really quick. Of course, my usual mini for shot. I have all my stuff in here Tylenol, lipstick, hand sanitizer, all of that. That will definitely fit right there. And then I have my little Chanel wallet. I can actually fit that in the front, which, yeah, you know what, that might be okay, because it's such a skinny little card holder, but yes, of course, it goes in the back, and I can also hide it back here as well, and then my six ring key holder, that will go, actually, let me see if I can put that one in the front, yep, that'll fit in the front, and then my key fob, um, it's kind of bulky, but it'll go anywhere really because this is a pretty like big size bag and then well, let's do a hand cream a hand cream can go in there as well it's kind of heavy y'all that's another thing this is a chain so it is going to get heavy so be mindful of that as well when you're um, trying it on because when you first try it on you're like oh it's, it's nice and um kind of light not so heavy with the chain but when you put stuff in it's heavy i'm not gonna lie but yeah you want to have this like lugging around your shoulder all day I don't, i'm not sure so but yes you guys let me know what you think down below do you love this little logo thing do you hate it i'm on the fence i think it's a beautiful like silhouette of the bag but i don't know how i feel about this really and this i've had for a while but like i said i don't usually use this bag just because i don't want to scratch this and i don't know it's just like i, don't, I mean i would I don't know. We'll just watch the versus one to see which one I would pick. Because <laughs> I was going to say 
what I would think about that but we'll save that for that one for another video but yes you guys I hope you enjoy this video if you have any questions comments leave them down below I love talking to you guys and also make sure you follow me on Instagram it's at makeup love Davina and then of course hit that subscribe button but yeah guys that's pretty much it thanks for watching beauties bye y'all